2K Sports welcomes you to the following presentation of the NBA. It's the NBA on 2K Sports. Alongside Doris Burke and Greg Anthony, this is Kevin Harlan. And on the sidelines, Hall of Famer David Aldridge. It's the Miami Heat taking on the Boston Celtics. It'll be the Heat off the tip. Now here is Hardaway. So with Holiday sitting on the bench, this is who Eric Spolstra has on the floor. Haslam's out there with Jimmy Butler. Then it's Jim Hardaway. Then there's Dwayne Wade. And it's morning in at the five spot. Ball's knocked loose. And it's out of bounds. The Heat will take it the other way. Miami ball. And here is Hardaway. Passes it to Haslam. Wade surveying the D. And it's Bird with the rebound. Boy, if you're going up against this guy in this close a range, you've got to defend with everything you've got. A tremendous job defensively. Well, that's not the guy you want guarding him at the rim. Just too much of a differential in terms of size. Side Hardaway over Kuzi. Hardaway, no good. Listen, he knows he should have made that shot. We'll see if they can work it back to him in that same area. Miami foul. Wayne Wade. First personal foul. First trip to the free throw line foul. for him in this one. At the line for the Celtics, John Havlicek. At the line for two shots. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. That's good from Applejack. Yeah, and among the many things to like about Hondo, he is strictly about the team. Willing to take on any role, he just wants to win. Oh, free throws. Good from Havlicek. And at the line, it's all about consistency with him. His routine, his stroke, it never wavers. Outside Butler. Hardaway with it. Out to the right wing. Here's Butler. Out to Wade. Just five to shoot. Got a piece of it. Hardaway for three. Again, the miss by the Heat. Pavlicek against Wade. Nice ball movement by Boston. To the middle. And there's the whistle. Three-second violation. Three-second violation. Heat ball. They need a good offensive possession. Yeah, they've gone a long time without a bucket. And that one clearly a foul. Gets the whistle and two shots coming up. Boy, with his power and explosiveness, when Butler gets inside, it's typically a bucket, a trip to the line, or sometimes worse, both. The Heat shooting their first free throws of the game. First one at the line is good. But Jimmy Butler is one of those guys whose work ethic seems to permeate an entire organization. There's the competitive spirit, the will to win. Those things always resonate with his teammates. Now, here is Havlicek. Pass to Cowan. 
Bird against Butler. Knocks it loose. And it goes out of bounds. That one off Butler. And now the latest from our reporter, David Alder. I was able to talk with Casey Jones for a minute. He was worried about their interior defense. He doesn't want them getting gutted in the paint. He told his players, look, they're going to score, but we've got to make it difficult on them to give ourselves a chance to win. Guys, let's see if they can follow that advice. Thank you, David. They grabbed their own miss. And Morning sends it back. And that's his signature, Morning, a fantastic defender. Phenomenal at using those long arms to reject shots. Count it good. Wow, they finally get it to go down on their fourth try. First quarter of basketball, just over two and a half minutes play. Bird outside. Got a piece of it. And the pass to Russell. Great play by Bird to set it up. And once he got to the 10, I think he was surprised to find himself that wide open. But I think defensively, that is not the way you want to start. Giving up high percentage looks, that doesn't typically end well. The shot by Wade, no good. Boy, the offensive flow just isn't there right now. One for five to start the game. Here's Cousin. He's guarded by Morning. Pass to Collins. Six on the shot clock. Russell, no luck. Miami trailing. Outside Hardaway. Passes it to Butler. And wrestling for it there, but no one has possession. We'll have a jump ball. A sensational block that definitely deserves another look. Well, they didn't make it this far by giving up easy ones. And now their defense is in overdrive. So it's Boston now. Here's Kuzi. He's been quiet so far. Still no points in the game. For the three. Kept alive by Boston. The kick out to Havlicek. Pass to Bird. From outside the arc. And it's morning with the rebound. Bird's gone one of three from the field here. Here's Wade. Great D that time from Bird. And his defense so valuable. Not many can bother that shot at the rim. Boy, you see the effort. You see the range. This guy prides himself in his ability to shut you down. And he could not get that one to go. Out of contact, and he'll go to the line for two. It goes on Tim Hardaway. Yeah, every generation or so, a player comes along who can be considered a true superstar. Folks, that's Larry Bird. And he makes the first. Bird hits them both. Here's Hardaway. He kicks to Wade. Outside Hardaway. Back to Wade. And the layup falls. See, these difficult finishes take incredible concentration. And Dwayne Wade is accustomed to taking those hits. And you love seeing that great mobile one drive a second time. And you got to love the aggression that he had taking it to the rim there. Sets the tone in a close game like this one. No good from Bird. Boy, with his shot not falling right now, it might be time to look in a different direction. See if you can get your teammates started. 
second. Team. The Heat shooting their third and fourth free throw attempts of the game. Two for Miami. Wayne Wade. The line for two. Good from Wade. Hard not to be impressed by Dwayne Wade's natural ability as a scorer. I mean, he works hard, no doubt, but this guy just has a gift for finding his shots. Celtics making a switch here. Tatum's checked in. And it's tied up with that one. And the Celtics with possession here. Fires from deep. And there's Havlicek. That's good on the assist by Tatum. Havlicek's got five minutes. Well, this is the aspect of Tatum's game that is most improving. The ability to manipulate defenses and find an open teammate. Now, here's Butler. And there's the pass to Hardaway. Six to shoot. From 18 feet away, and it's Russell with the rebound. Well, you, you have to like their work on the boards, Kevin, particularly here to start the game. Yep, it counts. He's got seven. And a nice job here early of establishing an inside presence. Wade outside. Now Hardaway. feet away and he knocks it down. Hardaway. Hardaway has got his second bucket of the game to go. Well, the versatility he possesses makes him a very tough cover, guys. Applejack outside. Kuzi. No good from outside. The Heat trail by three. Wade outside. Feeds it to Haslam. And the jam by Udonis Haslam. One of the very best. Wade will get you the rock. So the timeout, Celtics timeout. called timeout. They're first. Celtics. They're trying to snap them out of this little slump. Just feels like the basket is looking awfully small to them right now. They're having a hard time getting anything to fall. Both teams making some changes here. Celtics Entertainment. Jones, the pass to Pierce. And Paul Pierce with the slam. Now hit a man in stride. That is a textbook delivery. And so Holiday will bring it up for the Heat. It's a three-point game. Pass to Struess. To hero. Pocket six. Over to the wing. Jacks up a three. And it's Cruz missing. Celtics leading by three. And Pierce, here we go. The kick out to Tatum. And the officials call him for a three-second violation. Heat ball. The Heat trail by three. Passes to Autobio. Over McHale. The shot by Autobio, no good. Now here's Jones. Pass to Pierce. Kicks it out to Jones. The pass to Brock. Shot clock at six. It's tipped. Pass to Struess. Right wing. 
Here's Autobio. Up again. Great positioning on the putback. Yeah, and Morning's just a beast on the glass, using that muscular frame to get into prime position there on the board. Now here's Tatum. He's still scoreless so far in this one. Passes it to Pierce. McHale trying to free himself. And another miss by Boston. Pass to Struce. And oh boy, a lot of contact there, but he gets the call in will shoot two. It goes on Jason Tatum. And you know what? You allow a guy to get right to the rim like that. That's the only option. Man, let's get your take, guys, on the scoring breakdown for the Celtics. Straight away, they, they've opened things up offensively with skillful passing, running smart plays, and just setting guys up for success. And they've also shown dominance in the paint so far tonight, really putting the work in down low. That one drops. He ties it up. So they now lead by one. And Boston has possession. Brown outside. And here's Tatum for three. Rebound by the Heat. And here's Holiday. Still looking for his first bucket in this one. Inside. And Tatum pulls it down. Pass to Brown. Shoots from 12. Jones, no luck. Outside Holiday. Pass to Struce. Heat moving the ball around. Pass to Morning. Just five on the clock. Miami needs to get a shot off. Pierce with the steal. Right side Tatum. Jones trying to get open. And two free throws coming up. Unable to get that one to go with all the content. Tatum has worked very hard to improve his finishing game. And that includes sometimes taking contact and earning a trip to the foul line. And a chance to catch up on some numbers here. The scoring breakdown for the Heat. In the early going, they've been heat-seeking. Very crafty at drawing contact to work themselves to the line. Another big component of their early game tonight has been points off turnovers. Great job converting on those chances. And so Tatum nails them both. What impresses me about Jason Tatum are his work habits, his commitment in the offseason to adding something else to his arsenal. We know he can play high-level basketball on both ends. The sky is the limit. Now here's Adebayo. No points in the game yet for him. Hits the three-point bomb. And what can Adebayo do? I mean, gets the tough rebounds, scores the tough baskets, and then makes the right pass. Round against Hero. Back to Jones. Pass to Pierce. The Celtics need to get a shot off. Brown outside. Again, the miss by the Celtics. The Heat with the lead. Adebayo high post. And Adebayo throws it down. And this is too easy for Adebayo. Once he's close to the rim, he is going to damage it. Outside Tatum. And Jones has it in the corner. Over Holiday. No good there. And Miami the other way now. Adebayo down low. McKeel's there. Boy, the wheels have definitely fallen off in this quarter. He cannot buy one. Pierce finds Jones. Tatum on the wing. Jones trying to get open. And Tatum with the basket on the assist by Jones. Tatum's got five points so far. 
Now Tatum doesn't need a whole lot of space. You give him any look from three and you're in trouble. Shooting foul as the whistle blows. He'll shoot two free throws. First personal foul. Miami shooting their seventh and eighth free throw attempts for the game right here. Shooting for Miami. Man, Alabama taking two shots. First one drops. He hits both from the strike. You just have to be more disciplined. I mean, too many fouls and free throw attempts for the opponent. Outside Tatum. The pass to Pierce. Kicks to Brown. Here's McHale. And he's fouled pretty hard on that shot, but he's got the chance to pick up the points at the line. It's going to be on Bam Adebayo. Yeah, the defender all over. For Boston, they have made all of their free throws so far tonight, going six for six. the line for two shots. Shooting two. That free throw missing. And he's good on the second. And so it's Holiday with it. He'll bring it up for the Heat. Pass to Morning. Four seconds left, and the layup is good. And how about the strength from Morning powering through the contact and converting there? And so the first quarter is in the books. Miami ahead, up by four. We'll get things started in the second quarter when we return. Twenty-five. to get back into the action here in game one. Let's see what this quarter has in store for us. And let's quickly break down the game we've seen from Miami, guys. You, you got to credit their defense, communicating, rotating, making plays on the ball. Yeah, I think they wanted to come out of the gate strong, and they have. They've taken the early lead here. Celtics trail by four. They've got Tatum. Russell is out there with Havlicek. And it's Cowens in at the power forward position. That's who's in the game for the Celtics. Now, here is Russell. Havlicek kicks to Tatum. Passes to Kuzi. Six to shoot. Good, and it's Tatum picking up the assist. Kuzi's got himself going with the triple, his first basket of the game. Wait outside. Pass to Butler. And it's sent back by Russell. Man, guys, this is where instincts come into play. So much you have to read defensively. Russell not fooled at all. Here's Collins. He's gotten some minutes, but nothing on the board yet. And there's the foul. It goes on Jimmy Butler. That is his first foul of the game. And it's Jim Hardaway with the foul. That'll be his second foul of the game. And that's foul number two. And maybe you don't sit him at this point, but you really have to be careful to not pick up another before half. Here's Kuzin. Guarded by Hardaway. And you love how much heart Bam plays with defensively working overtime on that possession. And there's the foul on the shot. He'll go to the line for two. 
second personal foul. On the night, he's gone two for two at the strike. Shooting for Miami, Jimmy Butler at the line for two. That one is off. Larry Bird's checked in for the Celtics. And the second free throw, good. Quarter number two with just over a minute gone. Have a check outside. Now the pass to Kuzi from downtown. Rebound by the Heat. Down low, here's Hardaway. Well-timed pass, and he goes straight to the bucket for the layup. Hardaway has got the lead up to four now for the Heat. And here's Boston. Kuzi passes to Cowan. Three-pointer, Bird. They get it again. He can't get that one to fall. The Heat leading by four. Here's Butler. Nice D from Bird. So it's the Celtics now. In the second quarter, they've given up just three points. The shot's good from Kuzi. That's his second bucket from range this quarter after hitting none in the first. Outside Butler. Wade against Havlicek. No good from Wade. On offense, here are the Celtics. And here's Bird for three. And again, Boston with the triple. Oh, that's two bombs in a row from long range. Eight outside. Pass to Haslam. Butler feeling it out a bit. Hard away from outside. Miami no good on that time either. And I like the ball move the point right back at him to return the three, but he just couldn't get it to go. They get a bet. Well, when you've been struggling as he has, you love that your teammates have really stepped up and taken the challenge. Wait, wait. Quick job of getting up the floor and creating early offense. You don't give the defense any chance to set up. Sometimes you just love an easy look. Passes it to Kuzi. From 11 feet away, he's been getting another chance here. Collins, Russell. It's good on the putback. Time out, time out. And this is the problem. The, the length, the timing. Russell, one of the very best at corralling misses and turning them into points. And Miami calls their first time out of the game. Miami trailing. Outside Butler. Back to Hardaway. Passed away. Good ball movement here by Miami. Boston foul. John Havlicek. First personal foul. Second team foul. And in the second quarter, a little under three and a half minutes played already. Here's Butler. 20 feet out. And it's Wade. Wade, Wade. That time on the assist by Butler. Assisted. Wade's Jimmy. got the game tied up here for the Heat. Well, this is one of the strongest aspects of Jimmy Butler's game. Playing making for his teammates. Over the years, boy, he has gotten so much better. Now, here is Havlicek. Seven points in the game. And Adebayo sends it back. Kuzi passes to Russell. Here's Cowens. Lost contact on the shot, and now a three-point play chance as he'll head to the line. And Kevin, they've dialed up their activity this quarter. You We're seeing them convert a lot of those second chance opportunities. And this is his first trip to the line tonight. Team foul at the line. Dave Cowens at the line with one shot. How about that skill set that Cowens possesses? 
shoots a high clip from the field and rebounds the ball well at either big man position. Now, here's Butler. Here's the pass to Autobahn. Now, here's Butler. From 20 feet out, that falls. Nice feed that time from Dwayne Wade. Butler's got five points so far. The Celtics with the lead. Here's Kuzi. He has six to the inside. Russell, no good. And it's Adebayo with the ball for the Heat. Here's Butler. No luck that time on the shot that would have put them on top. Here's Kuzi. And foul on the shot. He'll shoot two at the free throw line. Third personal foul. And Kuzi, just an all-around talent. Superb passer. Who also rebounds well at his position. And, and guess what, folks? He can also score with the best of them. The first one falls. And that one goes in. Two from the line that time. And they have yet to miss a shot from the line here this quarter. Butler kicks to Hardaway. Wade outside. Shoots the three. A rebound by Bill Russell. Russell's got eight rebounds in this game. And they haven't been able to turn it into a big lead, but their rebound advantage is starting to add up. Haslam against Bird. With the putback. And it's Russell with that extra effort. Russell's got the lead up to five now for the Celtics. Oh, a nice tip in to salvage the points from that missed shot. And those second chance points can add up. Now here is Haslam. To the paint, here's Wade. Applejack with the rebound. It's stolen by Wade. Haslam, the pass to Hardaway. Wade against Havlicek. Back to Hardaway. Right side, Butler, and stolen by Russell. Inside. And it's Havlicek missing. Those are chances almost always you can rely on him to get you two points, but the D just enough to keep him out of rhythm. Oh, perfect timing on that alley-oop. Adebayo has a real time connection time time with his teammates. Time, time called here. The Celtics Sorry. decide to talk it over. Good timing. They're really struggling offensively. Sometimes it just feels like misses become contagious. He wants to settle his guys down right now. A different look for Miami. Morning comes in for Bam Adebayo. And Struz is subbed in for Udonis Haslam. Here's Havlicek. The shot, no good. Will he go the other way with it? Struz with it. Five points in the game. Boston foul. Larry third. First personal foul. Third team and this is his second trip to the line tonight. Three for Miami. Max Struz. Taking two shots. The first free throw is good. Celtics making a switch here. Pierce is checked in. Drew Holiday is checked in for Miami.
And so Struess nails both of them. Here's Kuzi. He's got eight. Havlicek outside. Pass to Bird. Russell against Morning. Kuzi can hit. Miami trailing. Now Struess. He's got seven. Shot clock at five. The 15 footer, and it's sent back by Russell. Left side Pierce. Russell trying to free himself up. Pierce, the pass to Russell. Morning with some nice D. And the activity he shows around the rim it is why he is such a respected defender. And what you love about his work defensively, the ability to challenge and change shots without fouling. Out to the right wing. Kuzi passes to Russell, and they call the foul. So he's got the and one chance here to make it a three-point play. And that's not his strongest trait, the, the unselfishness from Kuzi. Fantastic at realizing when one of his guys has an opportunity for a clean look. And he's got his first chance at the line here. And Jones checked in for the Celtics. And Miami with a change here, too. Tyler Hero, he's checked in for Tim Hardaway. Throw good, Russell. The Heat trail by four. Outside Holiday. This is a distruce. Pass to Hero. Tipped away. Butler. Rejected by Pierce. What a brutal night for this guy. And it is having a ripple effect throughout the team. This is tough. And the relentless nature that is Bill Russell. Always working for the best scoring opportunity. Won't find one better than that. And here are the Heat now. Following the bucket by the Celtics. Pierce against Buck. There it is. His second Jimmy make of the game. Must miss five. Don't you love the mentality of Jimmy Butler? He almost embraces the contact, invites the contact. Havlicek, the pass to Russell. And it's Miami with the rebound. Morning's got rebound number seven for him tonight. Hero, no good. Celtics leading by four. On the wing, Burr. Defended by Struess. Pierce finds Burr. Jones with it. There's the three. Jimmy Butler with the rebound. And the great shooters know when they've got enough opening to go for the three. I didn't think it was a bad choice on that possession. Now, Hero... He's been patient so far. Nothing on the scoreboard yet. A three. Bird pulls it in. Bird's got four rebounds now tonight. Outside Pierce. Bird outside. The pass to Russell. Pierce trying to break free. Controls the rebound and puts it back up and in. Russell's got the lead up to six now for the Celtics. And folks, he did not luck into that one. He knew just where he wanted to be to grab that backboard. Morning kicks to Struess. Trying to get open is Butler. A putback. He hangs in there and oh, catches it on the second chance points. Morning's got his third bucket of the night. So hard blue collar work ethic on display. This guy just beating everyone to the ball. Time call here. The hey, Celtics decide to talk it over. Make some noise, fans. And 
making some changes here for the Celtics. Kevin McHale, he checked in for Russell. Jason Tatum comes in for Larry Bird. And Jalen Brown subbed in for Jones. Havlicek kicks to Tatum. Havlicek against Holiday. Pass to Pierce. Over Butler. It's hauled in by the Heat. 110 left to play here in the half. And that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. First personal foul. He's had four chances at the line, made them all. Shooting for Miami. Max Cruz, two shots. Free throw good from Struess. And so Struess nails both of them. The Celtics with the lead. Havlicek dishes to Pierce. Tatum down low. Defended by Struess. Yeah, after a first quarter where they struggled from long range, they really started to get it closer to the basket. Outside, Hero. Back to Holiday. Some nice ball movement here by the Heat. Passes it to Struess. And stolen by Tatum. Brown wide open. He fires. Good, and it's Tatum picking up the assist. Tatum's got three assists now in this one. The Heat trail by seven. Outside, Hero. Up top, Struess. Pass to Butler. To the inside. And the rejection by Tatum. Probably the most underrated aspect of Jason Tatum's game is his defense. Size, length, strength, you name it, sends that one back. Launches a three. That shot misses. And so it's Boston. Heading to the bench with a seven-point lead as we wrap up the quarter. They're playing a bruising game inside, and it's working for him. He'll take a quick break and then back to the action here. The 2K Sports Halftime Show. Hello again, everybody. Halfway through this round one matchup of the NBA playoffs, Ernie Johnson, Kenny Smith, and Shaq. Taking a look at the Celtics, they've put themselves in decent shape to grab that all-important game one victory. So far, they've clearly been the better team controlling the flow. By no means is it a runaway, but they've put themselves in a great position. And let's get your thoughts, big fella, on the Celtics. They were getting after it on the glass. Like, wow, they were... They got a nice edge in that department, which has led to this lead. They won the heart and hustle battle in that first half. Now we'll see if they can keep that going. And Kenny, what are your thoughts on Miami? They didn't shoot the ball very well. That's because they didn't have any flow on offense. I'd expect the coaching staff to make some adjustments in the locker room. They need to draw up some plays to get a good offensive rhythm. And that does it for our halftime show. We now take you back to Kevin Harlan for the start of the third period. Headed to the floor right now, it's NBA playoffs round one. Thanks for joining us as we get back to the action on the court. You look at Bill Russell in this game, he has been everywhere. Well, it didn't take him long to get that double-double. Already has it halfway through the game. That takes a level of aggression and a level of focus, and he has brought it all night thus far. And we're happy to have you back for more playoff basketball here in round one. So with Holiday sitting on the bench, this is who Eric Spolster has on the floor. Hasm's out there with Morning. Then there's Jimmy Butler. Then there's Hardaway, and it's Wade in at the two. Here's Russell. 
Uses the glass to finish the way. Russell's got the lead up to nine now for the Celtics. They're finding lanes to the hoop now with consistency. Five buckets in a row from the paint. And that was another look at the fantastic mobile one drop that happened a moment ago. He's doing everything he can to put this game to bed. And great score there to help his team. And that's out of bounds. Miami will retain possession. Great instincts from him to get a hand on that pass and tip it out. And offensively, a little bit of a careless toss. You could have used a better angle on that pass. And that's a block right there. He swats that ball away with some energy. And this is postseason play at its finest, refusing to give up shots here in the playoffs. And it's the Heat with the ball. They trail by nine points. And stolen by Tatum. The pass to Kuzi. Miami foul. Tim Holloway. Fourth personal foul. First team foul. These are his third and fourth free throw attempts of the game. Bob Kuzi at the line for two. And he knocks down the first one. Havlicek, he's checked in for Tatum. Both shots good from the strike. The Heat trail by 11. Hardaway passes to Wade. Boston foul, John Havlicek. Second personal foul, first team foul. And about a minute of action so far in the third quarter. Outside Butler. Pass to Morning, and too much time in the lane. They get called for the three-second violation. And that is just a deflating error on his part. Well, I think it kills your energy, and it certainly kills your momentum. Here's Kuzi. Bird right side. And it's Haslam with the rebound. The Heat trail by 11. Outside Hardaway. Pulls from the top of the key. And that one hits back iron. Just a solid performance on the interior. The rebounding has been off the chart. Kuzi passes to Bird. Here's Collins. Pocket six. Wide open look. Again, the miss by the Celtics. All alone from mid-range. They know he won't miss many of those. Wade kicks to Hardaway. Passes to Butler. Celtics foul. Bill Russell. First personal foul. Second team foul. Here's Hardaway. He's got six. Pass to Haslam. Six on the shot clock. Back to Hardaway. Puts up a three. This guy just can't find his rhythm. And you look up at the scoreboard, they absolutely need his productivity. Here's Haslam. And they start the second half with three straight misses. None of the miss, and they've really hit a rough patch here. Butler against Burke. Again, the miss by the Celtics. And they're one of four here to start the second half. Hardaway for three. That doesn't go either for Hardaway. Wow, another empty possession out of the gates. 0 for 4 in this half. Brutal. Bird misses. Boy, a forgettable night for him, but thankfully his teammates have played well overall. And 
on the call, on the shot, it sends him to the line. It's on Larry Bird. You can tell every time down the floor, Jimmy Butler trying to make a play right there, drawing Jimmy contact. Butler. He's gone three for four from the line. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. First one falls for Adebayo is checked in for the Heat. And he makes both free throws. Celtics leading by nine. Havlicek outside. Up top, Bird defended by Butler. Bird can't get that one to fall. And the well is running dry for him right now. Nothing falling. And this is where you hope that he can find something easy so he can see the ball go through the net. And, yep, that's going to be a flagrant foul. Unnecessary contact. Boy, a, a very hard foul that time. Oh, and the officials oh, had to slap him with the flagrant. Oh, I mean, you can't oh, let him get away with that kind of contact. Yeah, gee, that's an easy call for the officials to make when there's that much contact. The league is really cracking down on those sort of plays. First free throw is good. Bird hits them both. We're still waiting for that first miss from the line to this half. Cowens passes to Russell. Now here's Bird, defended by Butler. Just over three and a half minutes through the third quarter of play now. To the middle, looking to end his cold spell. And he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. Third personal foul. This is his third trip to the free throw line. At the line for the Celtics, Larry Bird. At the line for two shots. He's off on the first. He hits the second from the line. And it's Wade with the ball for the Heat. A 12-point game. And the pass to Morning. Butler goes in over Bird. And a lot of contact on that one, so he'll shoot two here. Well, with that frame and rugged mentality, there is never a moment where Jimmy Butler will shy away from contact. This will make four trips to the line so far in the game. The line for two. Free throw, good Butler. So Butler nails both of them. Celtics leading by 10. Time called here. The Celtics decide to talk Celtics. it over. Trying to snap them out of this little slump. Just feels like the basket is looking awfully small to them right now. They're having a hard time getting anything to fall.
Kuzi. Passes it to Havlicek. Here's Kuzi. He's got 10. Four on the shot clock. Bird. Miami grabs the miss. Morning's got 13 rebounds in the game. Class eating. Butler on the win. Defended by Bird. And he gets the whistle for the three second call. Celtics leading by 10. Here's Kuzi. The feed now to Havlicek. Pass to Cowan. Five to shoot, and Morning sends it back, and he's able to get it back. Perfect foul, Bill Russell, second personal foul, fourth team foul. The Heat trail by 10. Wade outside. And Russell in familiar territory. Double-digit rebounds now. It's a plus-five advantage for them in rebounding after that one. Kuzi passes to Bird. Off target from three-point range. Well, he hasn't proven to be much of a floor spacer for them. He had the 1-3, but that was back in the first half. Here's Otobio. And foul on the shot, so he'll get a chance at the line. Wow, they've made every free throw here in the second half. And a breakdown here, guys. The hustle stats for the Celtics. They made a point to protect the rim. Challenging shots all game long, and the block total is off the charts. Second chance points have also been a big part of what's happened in this game. Crashing the boards Shooting with two. authority, turning those opportunities into second chance points. Boy, big time, big time on the offensive glass. That free throw, no good. Good on the second free throw. Celtics leading by nine. Kicks to Havlicek. Now the pass to Kuzi. Here's Collins. He's guarded by Morning. And Morning sends it back. And so it looks like the Celtics will retain possession here. Six to shoot. It's stolen by Adebayo. Lobbed up there for Wade. It's tipped. It'll go. The Boston lead is cut down now to just seven on the basket from Adebayo. You see the offense coming around for Adebayo. Entered the league with raw skills, but he's had the benefit of great coaching. Now, here is Havlicek. Seven points in the game. Pass to Collins. Five on the clock. To end the cold streak. And it's Havlicek missing. And I think that one could have easily have fallen for him. Down low. And Morning throws it down. Strong move to the 10, trying to get his guys going. Hard not to get motivated, G.A., right when your teammate makes that kind of play. Where was the defense? No help. You can't afford to give up these kinds of buckets. 
here's Collins. He's guarded by Morning. Let's it go from 14. The shot by Collins, no good. The Heat trail by five. Here's Hardaway, and another basket for Miami. Hardaway. They're getting beat up pretty badly out there. And I don't care what anybody says. You can't keep the status quo. If it ain't working, you got to make some changes. Here's Kuzi. He's got 10. Here's Havlicek. Again, the miss by the Celtics. He is just not taking smart shots out there. A pattern he has fallen into tonight. Outside Butler. Passes it to Wade. Over Kuzi. And it's Cowens with the rebound. Cowens has got rebound number 12 here already in the game. Pass to Havlicek. Russell trying to free himself up. And oh boy, a lot of contact there, but he gets the call and will shoot two. It's on Alonzo Morning. Team foul. He's gone two for two at the line so far. John Havlicek at the line for two. And he knocks down the first one. So both teams changing it up here. Free throws good from Havlicek. The Heat trail by five. And there's the pass to Struess. Now Hero. Another shot. Here's Autobio. Persistence pays off as they finally hit a shot. Autobio's got 11 points. Something that's kept this game close is the fact that the rebound stats for both teams are almost identical. It appears always being great at just getting into the heart of the defense. Feels real comfortable when he's in attack mode around the rim. First trip to the free throw line for him tonight. Jalen Brown's checked in for the subs. Heat also with the sub. Wade's checked in. The line shooting one. good from Pierce now here's Wade eight points for him outside hero Wade against Tatum Holiday the pass to Autobio kept alive the third shot of the possession finally falls for him 13 points in the game second chance points kill you it's a strength of Adebayo Picking up the garbage and putting it in. It's Pierce on the way. Takes a three. Here's Tatum. And contact on the shot, so he'll be shooting free throws here. It's going to be on Bam Adebayo. No question, he got bumped on that shot. This is his second trip to the line in this one. Jason Tatum at the line for two shots. That one falls for Tatum. Udonis Haslam. He's checked in for morning. <laughs> and 
And so Tatum nails them both. The Heat trail by six. Outside, Hero. Holiday, the pass to Autobio. Back to Holiday. Two free throws coming up, and they call the shooting foul. Here, here, credit Holiday for getting to the line on that one with his quickness and length. I'd like to see him do that more often. He's getting his first free throw attempt of the night right now. Two shots. Shooting two. And he makes the first. That one falls, so he hits both of them. Here's Kuzi. He's got 10. Outside Tatum. Left side Brown. Austin again missing. The Heat trail by four. Adebayo finds Wade. Looks it up for Adebayo. Pierce with the steal. Good, and it's Tatum picking up the assist. Tatum's got four assists now tonight. And when your mechanics are as strong as Pierce's, putting up a quick shot is not that hard. Now, Hero. Nothing yet on the scoreboard for him. Two minutes remaining. Holiday, the pass to Autobahn. Two minutes. Shot clock at six. Hero, that's a two-pointer. Offensive rebound. This one for three. The shot comes out. And with him missing literally everything he's put up today, you can see why the score is what it is. Here's Tatum. Pierce trying to break free. And that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. Second personal foul. Well, you like the level of aggression right there from Jason Tatum. Committed to scoring on the interior and draws the contact. So far, he's hit all of his shots at the foul line, going four for four. That one falls for Tatum. And that's good as he hits both of his shots. Here's Wade. Eight points for him. Pass to Hero. He kicks it to Holiday. Up and in on the way. Holiday. Holiday's got four this quarter. And defensively, they are on their heels every time the ball comes inside. Kuzi passes to Brown. Here's Collins. Nice ball movement by Boston. Tatum looking around. To the middle. Pass to Kuzi. Over Holiday. Kuzi can't hit. And so it's Wade. He'll bring it up for the Miami Heat. They trail by six. Pass to Hero. And the officials three. call him for a three-second violation. The Celtics making a switch here. Havlicek is checked in. For the Celtics. John Havlicek. Here are the Celtics with the ball. Outside Pierce. Throws it up high. And his passing is probably the most underrated part of Pierce. his game. Pierce is a terrific playmaker on that wing. Wade passes to Autobio. Great D that time from Tatum. 
Celtics leading by eight. One second separate in the shot clock in game time. The pass to Haslam. Played outside. Unable to get that one. And so it's Boston, holding on to an eight-point lead, heading into the break. They've been active hands and have forced a lot of turnovers in this one. Back right after this. Let's listen in on what Eric Spolstra had to say to his team. Trust each other. Take that ball moving. Ball moving. No holds. No holds. Well, moving the ball is so important to these coaches. I mean, it helps make the offense run smoothly, Kevin. When you move the ball, more scoring opportunities open up. Well, it doesn't get much better than playoff basketball. Let's get back to the action here in round one. We've got Pierce, also Tatum out there, and it's Havlicek in at the two spot. That's who's in the game for the Celtics. To the inside. Here's Pierce. Tatum at the elbow. Collins passes to Havlicek. Clock at four. Poked loose. Wade against Havlicek. Outside Hardaway. Pass to Buck. And it's blocked. Butler against Tatum. Goes back up. That shot is off. Morning with some nice D. The Heat trail by eight. Passes it to Hardaway. Pass to Morning. Wade with it. From past the arc. Rebound Boston. Cowens has got rebound number 13 for him here tonight. Kuzi passes to Tatum. Driving the lane over Butler. And the basket by Tatum. And the Celtics lead by 10. But Jason Tatum worked hard, being comfortable in tight windows off the dribble drive. That was a nice-looking move. Back to Hardaway. And we're about two minutes into the fourth quarter now. Lock at six. Here's Butler. And that one goes long. Boston leading by 10. Here's the pass to Tatum. Back to Pierce. Tatum on the wing. Over Butler. They get it back. The Heat trail by 10. Guys are looking for a spark here. Yeah, a cold stretch offensively, for sure. And Hardaway always looking to incorporate his, his teammates. You can see him keeping his eyes moving in order to make sure he's ready to deliver it to the open man. And Morning sends it back. Launches it. And it's Butler missing. And the Celtics with possession here. A great fourth quarter, just giving up two points. Here's Cowens. Tries again. And Pierce finishes inside. Well, he had trouble making shots in the first period, but rounding into himself here in the second. Wade outside. There's the pass to Butler. That doesn't go either for Butler. I'll tell you, it's been a struggle for him in this period, and they're struggling as a result. On the wing, Havlicek. Wade is covering. Here's Pierce. And the layup is good. 
And now it's a 12-point Boston lead. I'll tell you, he's been much better in the second half. He's taking smarter shots. He's looking more comfortable. And guess what? He's in a groove. Now here's Wade. Pass the bump. Puts it up. That falls. Nice Jimmy feed that time Butler. from Dwayne Wade. Butler's got four points this quarter. But Jimmy Butler is so effective as a basketball player because he can get to his catch-and-shoot game. He doesn't always have to dominate the ball. Here's Pierce. Passes it to Tatum. Here's the three. Not going to go that time. The Heat trail by 10 to the paint. And he gets the basket. Officials blowing the whistle, so a chance at the line for one more. That play shows focus and a will to score. Dwayne Wade welcomes that kind of hitting at the rim. Come on now. Russell, he's checked in for Pierce. Shooting one. Celtics leading by seven. Here's Kuz. Pass to Tatum. Dishes it to Havlicek. That's tipped. Stolen by Wade. And Wade slams it in. Out in the open floor, Wade can really turn on the Jets. Here's Boston now. They've held a 12-point lead early. The pass to Tatum. To the left side wing. Kuzi. Again, the miss by the Celtics. The Heat trail by five. Greg, I'm sure their coach is very pleased with their offensive flow right now. I mean, it's harder than it looks to get it going like this. Now they just have to maintain it. And Boston has possession. Jimmy Butler unable to get his last shot to go. Russell inside. Morning's there. The three from Tatum. Good on the triple. Tatum's got five points now this quarter. There was some question coming out of college. Could Jason Tatum hit the three consistently? He has put that to rest. Hardaway kicks to Wade. Outside Hardaway. Six to shoot. And it's Cowens with the rebound. Cowens has got rebound number 15 here tonight. Tatum no good. The Heat trail by eight. Dwayne Wade on the win. And the bank shot is good. Well, just continues to make his living from right there. Dwayne Wade feels so comfortable in the mid-range. Pass to Kuzi. Now Havlicek. Oh, Tatum in position. And stolen by Butler. Inside. And Tim Hardaway, the bucket on the assist by Wade. Wade's got five assists in the game. And another great look at the 2K drive. And that's the kind of bucket they needed. Close game in the second half. Great finish on that one. Russell, and that one, good. And you got to love Kuzi's ability to really create opportunities for his teammates. Just a pure point guard with superior passing skill. First team foul. At the line, Bill Russell. At the line with one shot. Trail by seven. Outside Hardaway. Passes to Butler. Oh, 
down low. It counts, and the foul. It's going to be on Bill Russell. Check out pointing inside where he operates with such confidence. This close in, he knows he's got the shot. Alonzo Morning, one shot. What's up? And you got to love the fire that Morning plays with his passion for the game is so special. Kicks it to Havlicek. They get a hand on it. Outside Hardaway. To the inside. Morning. Good. And the assist goes to Hardaway. Now just a two-point. Boston lead. And you don't want to allow too many of those short ones with the game right now in the balance. Here's Kuzi. Outside Hardaway. And Wade now top of the key. Outside Butler. It's to Hardaway. Shot clock at six. That doesn't go in. Had a chance, though, to take the lead. And here is Tatum. Yep, that one goes. Tatum's got 11 in the second half. Well, off the dribble, Jason Tatum continues to perfect multiple options in his arsenal. Back to Hardaway. He kicks it to Wade. He dishes it to Morning. Goes up again, and it's sent back by Russell. And they get it back. Morning can't make it work. Austin leading by four. And here's Tatum for three. Out of bounds. Miami takes possession. Heat ball. Larry Bird's checked in for the Celtics. And Miami with a change here, too. Autobio is checked in for morning. Timeout called the Heat. Bill Russell really making a difference here. You've got to take a timeout, take a breath, and come up with a plan for how to stop this guy. Take a look at the new balance player of the game, Bill Russell. And, and tell you what, he's worked very hard to get himself in good position throughout the course of this game. And that comes across in his shooting position. He's hit over half his shots from the field. And that's not because he got hot as much as it's because of the effort he put in to get himself open. And now we've got some time to check in from the sideline. They got for us, D.A.? Well, guys, during the last break, I listened to Eric Spolster address the team. He said, look, you guys are playing physical, and I like that, but it has to be under control. We've committed way too many fouls. We've allowed way too many foul shots. Kevin? Thank you, David. And it just seems that every pass they make is leading to a score. Just great ball movement. Have a check outside. The pass to Bird. Knocked away. Collins passes to Bird. Three-pointer. Russell. And it's Russell with that extra effort. Russell's got five points in the quarter. Smooth. Guys, very good job getting himself in close enough that he could just tip it back in. Well said. Those kind of plays in the offensive glass can tell the story sometimes, can't they? Timeout called the Heat. Once again, fans, Celtic Entertainment. against Havlicek. Wade passes to Haslam. And it's blocked. 
Wade against Havlicek. Here's the lob to the hoop. Trying to find Bird. He's got it now. Outside Butler. To the middle. Here's Autobio. Bill Russell grabs the miss. Celtics leading by four. Havlicek with it. Butler covering. And a bit of a battle here for the ball. The official signals a jump ball here. Miami with the ball. And it's Adebayo with the ball for the Miami Heat. Here's Wade. Misses off the left eye. 133 left to play in the final quarter. Going inside. And he's fouled pretty hard on that shot, but he's got the chance to pick up the points at the line. Second team foul. At the line for your Celtics. Johnson the check. At the line for two. on the first and that puts them up by five. So both free throws are good. And it's a six-point ball game. Well, it's about the little details. Capitalize at the free throw line. Add to your lead. Here's Wade. Trying to get up and is out of bio. And that one clearly a foul. Gets the whistle and two shots coming up. And it's on John Hamilton. You know this as well as I do. Dwayne Wade is looking for the contact. This is a big physical player who loves to mix it up a little bit. one and that brings them within five. game looks like they've got it just about wrapped up. Yeah, just got to work that clock and take care of the ball. Here's Havlicek at the 10th, and it's Russell with that extra effort. Bill Russell's offense is off the charts today. Well, not sure who was responsible for the block out, but this guy got in there and dug out his points. Wade. Yes, that goes in. Wayne, Wayne. This is an accomplished, polished interior score. Don't let the two-guard position fool you. Dwayne Wade from the cup. Oh, ho oh. Now, here's Burr. It's a four-second differential between the shot clock and game clock. Pass to Havlicek. 
Six on the shot clock. Over Wade. The kick out to Havlicek. And so it's the Boston Celtics with the W. A big playoff win for them. But what isn't great big in the postseason? Huh? Great point. I, I really just love the composure with which they played tonight. It, it, it's easy to get too beat up for postseason basketball, but they kept their heads and just went about the business of winning. And that about wraps it up for this broadcast of the NBA Eastern Conference quarterfinals. For Doris Burke, David Aldridge, Greg Anthony, and the rest of our terrific 2K Sports crew, this is Kevin Harlan saying thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. Got some heaven pins. Be on a different way. I am the veteran.